it's an argument over property and roads and who owns what. And basically, Rebecca Sherman's son is stuck on Oak Mountain in Salisbury and has been for several days over the Labor Day. And Rebecca, explain, first of all, good morning. Your son is hopefully doing okay. Yeah, good morning. We're concerned about him. He is pre-diabetic and he does have high blood pressure. Why is he stuck up there? What happened was in 1987, I purchased a piece of land for my husband for hunting. And we used it occasionally. And my purchase order was for a piece of land off Legion Road in the town of Salisbury, the village of Stratford, for 31 years. We've never had a problem going up. My husband passed away a couple of years ago, and uh, it was hard for him to get there, so we hadn't been going up regularly, but my son would go up for hunting. His friends would go up for hunting. We've never had any problems. We've never had any disputes. We go up Legion Road, cross over what is now the fire department's land, and get access to our property. Well, a neighboring landowner has told us this year that the property, 200 feet of the road, belongs to him. If we go to the county building, to the mapping department, they are saying that the road goes further. So from the county, we get one thing. From the town, we get another. I went to the town. The town says, absolutely, it belongs to him. There's nothing we can do. It's civil. We called the state trooper. State trooper said... He can't do this. He cannot block a road. New York state law says they cannot block you access. In turn, move the log and go in. So we did. We moved the log. We moved in my son's 32-foot travel trailer that he wants to live in and build a new camp. On the 28th, I believe it was, we did move the trailer in. He spent the night. The next morning, he heard bang, 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 bang. He was up there with two friends. And the landowner then proceeded to dump four, maybe five truckloads of dirt down the road. So he can't get out. And now you can't get out unless it's like a 45-minute trek up the mountain. Right, only through access from a neighbor. And if the neighbor doesn't allow you the access, we can't do it. So have you contacted a lawyer, Rebecca? I have a lawyer. The lawyer, in turn, has sent letters to the landowner. The landowner says he hasn't gotten them. I tried to speak with the landowner. He will not give me a response. In the meantime, he's there. My son has a friend that is willing to go in and uh, get arrested if necessary. You know, I don't like conflict. I tried to speak to him to get it done. He doesn't want to talk. He doesn't seem to care. I don't understand the law. So when you tell me that it's not illegal for a person to barricade a person on a road, I don't understand it.